Hey there, guys, this is Unlikely Bob for you. It is that time of the month again. Doesn't feel like it's gone that fast, but, well, here it is again. Loot Crate! Man, to this month is just crazy. It felt like yesterday I was doing the other one. Uh, Unity, that's what it was. This one's a bit differently shaped. It's a little bit more square, if you can see that. It's a little bit different. Not sure what to think of that. Excited, though. This month's theme is cyber, so... That could go many ways. If it does not include a Doctor Who Cyberman, I'm going to be kind of disappointed because uh, it's literally in the name. Cyber, Cyberman. Well, we should get to it, then. Here we are. I actually got a slightly larger table this time. Instead of the little tiny one like we usually have, I actually got a fairly large surface, so I'm pretty happy with that. I'm actually surprised I remembered to do that this time. <laughs> Well, no time like the present to open this up. And I also hope that the light isn't too glary over here. It's hard for me to see that on my, my, on my camera screen. Because the light is like right here. Here's my hand. Here's the light right here. I don't think it should be though. Ooh, this already looks cool. Let's see what we see. We start off with... Terminator Genesis Half Scale Endo Skull. That's pretty awesome. I'll have to check that out and look at it. May as well just do that right now. And it looks like this is a Loot Crate exclusive item. See, so yeah, that's just a little molded plastic Endo Skull. Probably put that in the window, scare neighbor. Especially if they got scared by the Terminator the first time. I actually don't know if you would get scared by the Terminator. You might. You might. You never know. Alright, that's that part. Sorry, I'm trying to open this up without crushing my pop filter like I just did. <laughs> oh, no, not a t-shirt again. Well, I mean, no, that sounds bad. I, I actually do like the t-shirts. It's just trying to figure out how to unfold it and show it on screen so you can actually see it. Yeah. Yeah, that's pretty awesome. I, th I, ooh, I'm so sorry. I believe that this is Transformers. Yeah, that's Optimus Prime, I think. It's hard for me to see it on my screen. Yeah, that's Optimus Prime. That's really awesome looking. Nice. For sure. And this appears to be a Terminator keychain. There we go. At my first glance, it kind of looked like a bar of chocolate. At my second glass, uh, glance, I actually don't know what it is supposed to be. Hopefully someone can help me out with that. Here, I'll open it up for you so you can see it better. So then the light's not glaring on the plastic there. Wait, it says, oh, it's a brain chip. Okay, well then, then, I don't need anyone's help figuring out what that is. Yeah, that that looks like a brain chip, for sure. <laughs> Definitely. Sorry about that. Had to just fix my recording. For some reason, it stopped recording uh, properly. So, we're going back to this. What is this? This is a... Well, it's a patch. For something. <laughs> I feel like I really should know this better, but I don't know what this is. I'll probably find it out in the magazine a little bit later on. And a pencil pouch that looks like a printed circuit board. With a carabiner clip on it. Nice. It's a nice shade of blue. I like this electric blue color. Aha! Said magazine. Get around to that in a minute. Let's just get the rest of it. Oh, wow. Wow. This is definitely a mouse mat. And it looks like this is Borderlands. I believe. Once again, haven't played Borderlands before, so I'm not sure. But I think that that's Borderlands. Watch as I'm completely wrong on that. I just am sounding like a fool now. And then this. For range facility use only. Battlestar Galactic Arrange Sheet. Command use uh, command issue cross rank service. See? That's interesting. What is what? 
is even in this? Ah, it's a poster. Well, one thing in here is. My, right, this is this is a poster. <laughs> With my limited knowledge of Battlestar Galactica, I'm going to say it's a Cylon. Maybe, maybe. <laughs> I don't know. I really wish I I could remember if that's what that was. I haven't watched Battlestar Galactica before. I've seen the movie, but I haven't really seen if I'm thinking the right thing. I haven't really seen much of it, I should say. I feel bad. I should know what this is. And then the other thing in here, in this range kit. Oh, it's a shooting range. Now I get it. <laughs> Put that back down so it's not just tipping over. Yeah, it's just another one of those guys. Cool. And then we all, of course, get our stickers. We have here... Join us for Nerd HQ 2015. Nerd Machine, San Diego, July 9th to 12th, 2015. That's is kind of short notice, guys. I feel like I should have known about this a lot longer ago if I was going to go. Have to kind of plan in advance here. <laughs> I don't think I actually probably would have gone, though, to be fair. So... That's, that's nice stickers, though. Almost thought it was, uh... What is that band called? Daft Punk. That's who I'm thinking of. Dear me, I could not think of their name whatsoever. That's just the end of the, uh, box, it looks like. And there's the button. I was wondering what happened to that. Cyber Button, 2015, June 2015. That's cool. Whoa. Loot Crate official member. That's interesting. I haven't seen that before. And unfortunately, there's no barcode on it. It's just just this plastic. Hey, that's better than nothing, at least. Nice. Well, anyways, guys, I think that that's actually probably the end. No, wait, wait. I wanted to see what, what these things were. Let me look in the, com in the catalog real quick. Oh, my. Look at this. This is the Mega Crate. Its value is priceless. <laughs> Here, I'll read it off to you. PC hand, PC case hand painted by Gearbox artists. Nvidia T Shield tablet. Nvidia GTX 960 graphics card. Borderlands loot chest full of comics and swag signed by the Creative Team. Borderlands Jack and Nisha poster one of ever one of four printed, ever printed. That's it. That's intense. Borderlands Jack Laser Mini poster rare print. I'm not sure what, which one of these that would be, because most of the time they have all the pictures of everything listed over, uh, shown over here. So I'm not sure what that one would be. However, check out this one. That might be what it's talking about, but at the same time, that's really awesome. If it's not, we also got Borderlands Two Logitech mouse. Borderlands, the pre-sequel character poster, one of two enter ever printed. Dear me, that's... Wow. Then we also have the Homeworlds Collector's Edition. Borderlands, the Handsome Collector... Uh, the Handsome Collection Collector's Edition. Yes, that's the one with the remote-controlled Claptrap. Really? Nice. Claptrap plush, directly from the offices at Gearbox team. Scrapbook of Claptrap's adventures at Gearbox. And welcome to Pandora T-shirt exclusive Gearbox Studio printing. Wow. So we're definitely going with the Borderlands theme on this one. <laughs> nice. So Bo Nerd HQ, as we were talking about, is actually created by Zachary Levi. That's cool. So yeah. The gaming mat, that one, is a Borderlands Zero. That's the character Zero from Borderlands. That's who that is. And this puppy right here, that is a logo patch from the future replicant corporate, uh, cor yeah, it's a future replicant corporate logo patch. Basically, the company that makes the replicants, that's their logo recreated. So you can wear it yourself. Hope this doesn't inspire someone to actually create them. Aha, I was right. That poster, you can see that in full view there, because I can't get a full view of it myself. 
is Cylons from Battlestar Galactica. I was right. Looks like that's the end of it, though. I do hope that you enjoyed this. Uh, I am quite disappointed that they did not include any uh, Cyberman stuff in this, to be honest. But you know what? That That's, that's all right. They'll get it next time, hopefully. <laughs> they might not have the permission to do that, so I'm not. I'm not counting on it, but... Anyways, guys, I hope that you enjoyed this, and if you did, please be sure to hit a like and a comment down below. It really helps out the channel, and also make sure to subscribe if you really enjoyed it. And I'll see you next time. So long, everyone. That did not stay at all. <laughs>